Well, ladies and gentlemen, our second contest this evening is a tremendous four-man knockout contest. The draw was made this afternoon, and the first contestants will be Marty Jones, wrestling Dave Duran. Can we scrub that, please? Can we scrub that? Ladies and gentlemen, our next contest is a tremendous four-man knockout contest. The contestants I will introduce as following. On my left and in the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, the Jamaican kid, Lenny Hirsch. Also on my left, a welcome please for the world champion, Marty Jones. On my right hand, standing in the red corner, a visitor to our shores from the United States, ladies and gentlemen, will you please welcome the East Coast champion, Scott McGee. And our fourth man making up the tournament, coming from Cheshire, ladies and gentlemen, a welcome for Dave Duran. Now, the draw took place earlier on this evening and the contestants will be as follows Marty Jones will wrestle Dave Duran that will be the first contest the other two will be Lenny Hurst taking on our friend from the United States Scott McGee now if the next oh, or the second two would like to return to the dressing rooms please we'll see you at a later date uh, as you leave the ring, I will remind you that your contest will be over a 10 minutes duration. It will be a one full contest only, and the final will be held over 15 minutes. Okay? Thank you, Roy Harding, our MC, has a Four Nations heavyweight knockout tournament here. Semi-final, first semi-final between Marty Jones for England and his opponent, Dave Duran, uh, now uh, living in Runcorn, Cheshire, but originally, of course, from Ireland. Therefore, Marty coming in with his glasses because so many people have asked him if he wrestles with them that he thought he'd come in with them this afternoon for a change just to maybe answer that question. But I can assure you, he won't, that won't last long. Ten minutes duration, each of these semi-finals. And Joe Dorazio, referee of the first one. Set away, commence one, one fall decides the contest. Joe Dorazio, the former middleweight wrestler from London, our full-time referee and Duran in his single leotard for Ireland versus Marty Jones the world mid-heavyweight title holder for England the next semi-final will be uh, Lenny Hurst from Jamaica versus Scott McGee of Tampa, Florida I don't believe that uh, Dave Duran, even with his uh, 16 stone 7 weight advantage of nearly 2 stone over Marty, has ever taken on Marty Jones before. He certainly hasn't on television time now, I don't think. But he's going to have problems here. Yes, you see, even with that extra weight, he still, the timing comes in so perfectly from Jones. See that far-reaching side head is really the arms right over the same side. Now he's switched back to the normal. Headlock and strangle. Nicely out by Duran. Yeah. 
Superlative rest lever throw. All from a rest lever. Really excellent time on this man. Double finger into lockdown. He's got a man one and three quarter stone heavier than he is. Down there. It's up nicely. But uh, <laughs> for how long? At the moment, Marty Jones really dictating this contest. I, I hope it doesn't happen all the ten minutes because I'd like to see Duran put up a, a pretty good show here. <coughs> the way that Marty holds on that side headlock, his own wrist locked. Helping the um, pressure. <laughs> Sixteen and a half stone across those ropes there. <laughs> oh dear. You won't like that. You won't like that. Naturally, one of the most popular wrestlers in the country today, Marty Jones, because he's one of, if not the best. That came far too late, and it's Jones going. Oh, that's one way out of trouble. She's taking lessons from um, Tally Hokey, I think. Of that, grabs the bottom rope whenever he's in trouble. Full Nelson Jones. So we will see. Uh, Two semi-finals here this afternoon. This Four Nations Heavyweight Knockout Tournament. And of course the final. Which will last 15 minutes. Two falls to the side. Five minutes gone. So halfway through this first semi-final. One fall to the side. Of Knee drop, face of the spine. And the clutch hold and slam. Cross press. Strong man, this Duran. Pushed him off quite easily there. spread with a vengeance here. If he, if Marty can hold that right foot down. Now, giving that up. Perfectly legal, that movement on the hand, on condition he doesn't separate the fingers. Illegal use of the ropes. So Garazio finally insists that he breaks. Oh, beautiful. There's timing. 
And again, beautiful time. Around to see. I think I'll have a break for a moment. He's getting counted. with Marty in the corner is always dangerous that foot comes up so quickly Six. and his opponent often walks straight into it or even runs tries to switch oh the knee came up that time and Marty just wasn't there anymore two minutes left so two minutes remain and this ten minute tag and it's Marty Jones going for the power lock and if he turns it's his new reverse power lock and that looks like it, a submission that he wants. Marty Jones trying out his new speciality from the power lock, the reverse power lock, which was same thing having turned into the hole. But it worked, and the submission required is there. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after eight minutes and 30 seconds of wrestling, with his very own special power lock, the winner of the contest by the one fall of submission required, Appreciation as he leaves the ring for Dave Durant. <laughs> <laughs> 